Hello YouTube, how are we doing today? I hope you're doing good wherever you are. It's a lovely day here today. So we're going to talk about 15 tips on how to use Pinterest for marketing. So what is Pinterest? Well, Pinterest is comparable to Twitter, but instead of sending tweets, you share images called pins. Other people can follow your pins. This allows you to increase your exposure to the web, share your products or messages, and increase your SEO rankings to get those all important backlinks. You can also improve visual branding. Attracting Pinterest followers is paramount to attracting new visitors and to boost your SEO. How to achieve this? Well, we're going to go through this today. And guys, if you have any comments, please leave them leave them below. And let's get to it. So, number one, add the button to your website. Probably the easiest way to generate more Pinterest followers is to add the Pinterest button to your website. You can find it under the, the menu About and then Pin It button. Keep in mind to place this in a strategic place on your site, allowing your visitors to pin any of your content straight away. And number two, add Pinterest to Facebook and Twitter. Link your Pinterest account with your Facebook and Twitter accounts. This way you can create value across all your social media channels and increase your exposure to, the, to your content. Number three, use best practices. Do you want to know what kind of pins people like? Look under popular and find out which pins people like. Look especially at the keywords in the titles and the hashtags that they were, that were used. Learn from the best practices and learn from the top pinners out there. There's some good stuff on Pinterest, guys. So get in there and see what's popular. Number four, place your pins strategically. Touched on this a little bit already. While you're looking for what works, keep an eye out for popular boards. Adding your pins to these boards will boost the exposure and impression of your pins. There's no need to reinvent the wheel on Pinterest, guys. To see what works and copy what works. Number five, perform a keyword analysis. Your pins are organized on boards. Give your Pinterest account and boards a name that stands out and makes it clear what your board is all about. This makes the boards more interesting to potential followers. Be specific. Names such as restaurants in London or city trips in England or real estate in California will attract more engaged followers and you will be able to add your keywords. A thorough SEO keyword analysis will give you insight and some quick wins. Number six, link to the right page. Whenever you refer to your pins in blogs or discussions, link directly to your pin or board. This makes it easier for people to find and to follow your pins. It also directs more SEO to your pages. And Pinterest is a great way of getting qualified backlinks to your site or blog. Number seven, go crowdsourcing. Adding your own pins takes time and effort. So why not let others do it for you? Get your customers or readers in gear and let them provide the content for you. Give your customers a reason to share. Is your company active in the travel or tourism? Ask customers to share their holiday pictures. Selling kitchen appliances? Then let people show off what they've made with your products. With some imagination, you can turn anything into a contest, immediately adding an incentive to participate. A contest is also an excellent content for your other channels. And number eight, keep on pinning. Once you've got your boards up and running, make sure you keep posting relevant pins. Don't post pins too frequently. Your Pinterest followers might see this as spam and stop following you. So keep the quality good, guys. Pinterest, there's loads of good stuff on there. Number nine, use hashtags. Like in Twitter, you can use hashtag to let people know what your, what your pin is about. Add hashtags with your keywords to your pins so they can be found by people that are looking for your products. Don't be shy with the hashtags and don't fear the hashtag. Number 10, comment on relevant pins. Be active and comment on relevant pins on other boards. Show your expertise, your interest or your appreciation. Make sure you add value. 
This will point people towards your profile and your pins. And again, don't spam. Number 11, follow your target audience. Often people that are followed will follow you in return as a token of appreciation. Find people within your target audience, follow them and introduce yourself. You can also follow people that might repin your pins so that you can get your pins out to their followers too. All this will increase your amount of followers. You can go get in touch with your potential customers and give your Pinterest account more clout. And number 12, valued content. Content is king. Yes, we know it's a cliche, but it's true. Use as many of the 500 characters with each pin. Add your SEO keywords and make sure that every pin has something interesting for your followers. Coupons, VIP content, QR codes, barcodes, pre-release images, image reviews, how-to tutorials. Be creative and it will be very much appreciated. Number 13. Grow organic. Tempting though it might be, don't buy any Pinterest followers. Concentrate on getting your content out there. Search engines are continuously getting better at weeding out false Twitter, Facebook and LinkedIn accounts. Being found guilty of black hat SEO will have a negative effect on your rankings. Number 14, get creative. Now it's time to create your pin boards. Before you start pinning, you must create the board you're going to pin it in. Think of the boards as categories. Pin boards are used to separate different categories of content of interest. Pinterest will give suggestions, tips for your pin boards. Tip number 15 is to get started. Now that you have all of these Pinterest SEO tips we've given, it's time to go and get started. You can see the clock, it's already five past now. The sooner you start, the sooner you can get your images, text and links out there. Pinterest is growing quickly. It's the fastest growing social media platform out there. Beat the competition and get started today. With these tips, you'll be able to increase the amount of Pinterest followers and the effect, and this will affect your SEO and those backlinks. It will also get your images and brand out on Pinterest and show it to a relevant audience. Good luck guys and get pinning. Don't forget to leave a comment down below. That's all for today's video guys. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to leave a comment down below. Also, check out a couple of other videos here to the side. I think you'll enjoy them. And don't forget to subscribe. Okay, cheers, guys. Till next time. Bye bye.